What up beautiful dreamers, it's your girl Bounty Dreamer and today's video is gonna be a little different in that we're not gonna be talking about hair but instead we're gonna go on a DIY mission and for those of you that don't know DIY stands for do it yourself so I'm gonna teach you how to make your very own EOS lip balms Ooh. as far as all of the products mentioned in the video that you're gonna need I'm gonna list them in the description box also so that you can know where to get them so enough of me talking let's do it what you're gonna need is beeswax, coconut oil, shea butter, and of course, almond oil. All of these ingredients are 100% natural and great moisturizers. You can also add food coloring or lipstick to add a tint of color. Of course, what you're also gonna need is an empty EOS container that's been cleaned out and ready to get going. No lie, it's a little frustrating cleaning out these things, especially in all the grooves, but it's possible. So it was a little tricky getting the little fan piece out of the bottom of the container. So what I did was use a knife and popped it out. And of course, once you've done that, make sure to clean out any remaining lip balm. Be sure to twist the fan piece into the top of the container because that's what you're going to pour your ingredients into. Now get you a plastic or glass bowl and let's mix. Beeswax, almond oil, coconut oil, shea butter, and lipstick right there. This is what it should look like after it's been melted and you can do this by popping it in the microwave or putting the bowl in boiling water. So now it's time to pour the mixture in and as you can see it already started to harden. So take your time and pour it in and make sure to pour it in above the little fan piece. Oops, spilled a little. And now it's time to pop this baby in the freezer for 10 minutes. Well guys, it's time for the moment of truth. This is the lip balm freshly out of the freezer and I snapped the bottom back on. Now let's just see if it works. And there you have it. Your very own freshly made EOS lip balm like you just bought it. And just an FYI, you can also add flavorings such as strawberry extract or even an essential oil so that it can have a yummy scent. It's all about creativity. Like always guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up so that I know to keep on doing DIYs and creative videos. And of course, subscribe if you haven't already done so. Peace!